Hello everyone, welcome back again to Anhao channel. My name is Anas and I'm working for you. So if you have any questions or any video requests, make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I don't reply to each comment. If you are wondering again why is that, because simply I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to make a transparent header on Shopify store. And I will show you that by the easiest way possible and it works on every team. And I mean it. And actually, I will do demonstration right now in this video for both uh, multiple teams so you can see if it's actually work for all of them or not and I promise you it works for all of them because I did face an issue lately when it comes to installing scripts and so on on Shopify stores the issue I did come across to is uh, it doesn't work always as it's supposed to and I mean for teams and versions because some teams it works fine for them and some others it doesn't and actually not just the teams even the versions of the teams for example an earlier version of the team it works fine on it but the newer version it doesn't work properly on it so i did face that issue a lot lately however i learned from them so i did make scripts that will work for every team and i mean every team on shopify store and as i said i will do demonstration for multiple teams in this video and what i mean by transparent header is actually the header that will be displayed right here and the video as you can see by the way uh, this banner right here i did make a video on how to add the banner video with the text and so on as well as the button in one of my tutorials so if you are interested in how to add this make sure to check out my channel so what i'm talking about here is this header right here will be transparent so what i mean by will be transparent is the video that you see right now on the banner will be displaying under the header and you will see that in this video so as i said the transparent header and it works for every team and by the way if you are interested in how to add the order tracking page to your shopify store where customers can easily track the order for the shipment just check out my channel i did make that video as well and without using any apps or anything like that and as well in this video we won't actually use any apps for this video we will use a really short script that will work for every team on every Shopify store and will make the header right here transparent so the video that you see right now is playing will be displaying under the header and that will look really good and you will see that in a moment and as I said I will do that also for other teams on my Shopify so I'm not sure which team let me check uh, I think I do have some other teams in here yeah I do have refresh team so I will use uh, the same trick on refresh team as well and we will see if it's working fine on them or not and i promise you it does it does work for every team and i tested it and without any more talking let's just jump to it so let's just close this or let's just keep actually the store open it in here and then we will do the trick and come back in here reload the page and see if it's actually working or not and it will work i promise so let's just get back in here so the first thing you're going to do once you access it, the shopify dashboard is obviously click on online store in here then access the team section and click on the three dots on the left of customize and you will see this menu and click on edit call right here and i just doing the navigation through click this and click that for people that are not familiar with shopify because i know uh, most of the people that search for these videos are the shopify beginners so that's why i mentioned every step in here after that you will need to access team.liquid file and you will find it right here uh, as the third one in here or you can simply search for it if you do not see it in here simply search for it on this bar right here by typing uh, team like this and it will show you holy shit what just happened as i said simply searching in here for a team then it will show you as you can see team.liquid so that's what we need in order to add transparent header to our shopify store so simply click on team.liquid right here and it will show you a bunch of code in here and no worries you won't edit any code or anything like that it's really simple and fast forward and it's really beginner friendly because you will simply copy and code and paste it in a specific section the only thing you will need to make sure of is and make sure you paste it in the exact or the correct section or the correct place on the code in here so in order to access the correct place or the correct section scroll down all the way down to the bottom of the page or actually this is depends on the team that you're using so forget about scrolling down uh, stay on the top of the page then click on the code just like this you want to edit it then click on uh, if you are on windows click on Control f i'm on mac i'm going to click on command f then it will show me this bar right here at the bottom of the page where we can search for things on the code i mean so click on find right here section then type in the forward slash right here then body just like you see right now 
uh, forward slash body then hit enter and it will show you the body section on the code right here as you can see so that's what you need to do in my case i'm using down chain for this demonstration the first demonstration as i said because i will uh, install this or i will use this and refresh team as well so in my case it's in at the bottom of the page the line number 182 so after you did find the forward slash body section uh, scroll down description box and you will see a link for code and yeah obviously it will be named as code simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here where you're gonna see a really short code as you can see it's 17 lines in here so this is the code that i was able to set a uh, transparent header or any shopify store or any shopify team so let's just select the code uh, so obviously select the code then right click oops let's just do that again then right click and copy so just copy the code then get back in here and paste it in this section right here and as i said make sure it's above uh, forward slash body just like you see right now not below forward slash body but above uh, forward slash body and after that simply save let's just save the code and let's just get back to the shopify store which is our shopify store in here and we will reload the page and after we reload the page we will see the video is displaying under the header and the header is completely transparent and it doesn't matter if it's sticky header or not it will work for all of them so let's just reload the page and see if it will work or not and i'm not sure it will so let's just reload the page and hair rinse check out how does it look like it looks really good as you can see so it's really transparent and this line you can disable it from the settings of the team customizer there's an option or you can toggle or disable for the line right here so as you can see this is the transparent header and even if i scroll down a little bit as you can see it still is transparent as you can see so as i said it works for every team and this is how it looks like for down team so right now let's just do that for refresh team to show you guys that it's actually working on every team not just the down team that i'm using right now and the refresh team i don't have the video banner right here i have just a regular picture so let's just access the down team in here let's just get back i mean refresh team sorry i apologize so refresh team here it is so let's just uh, check out the store how does it look like and here is this is how it looks like so this header we want it to be transparent just like the same as this one so we want to copy the code again so let's just copy the code and to just get back in here and click on the three dots again in here and click on edit code and we will do the same it's fairly the same and we are already on the team.liquid or just access it from here then the same uh, scroll down to see the body the closing of the forward slash body and paste it in here and here is as you can see it was pasted in here so let's just uh, save the changes so let's just get back to the refresh team here is and let's just reload the page and see if that's working or not and the same as the video banner right here uh, the picture right here should be displaying under the banner so let's just reload the page under the header sorry so let's just reload the page and here is as you can see it works fine on refresh team as well and not just refresh team it works on every team i promise you i just i don't have time to actually do demonstration for every team that video will be like an hour long so on and even if you do face an issue or anything like that just as i said in the beginning of the video i'm working for you so just drop me a comment below i will be happy to help you out but for now that's how you make a transparent header on shopify store for down team or any team and as i said again if you have any video requests or any questions just drop me a comment below i will be happy to reply to you or check out my instagram right here below me i don't reply to each comment if you are wondering again why is that because simply i'm working for you otherwise i think my job is done for this video so thanks for watching catch you on the next one